Welcome to State Television Company, Western Armenia. Broadcasts for today. The speech of the Speaker of the Government of the Republic of Western Armenia. Member of the European Parliament expressed on Armenian prisoners in Baku. Mir's message to the Armenian nation, Ashut Haratunyan. Swiss Emperor Heritage Fontobel and 15 other MPs sent a letter to the Swiss government on the issue of Armenians in Artsakh. The high areas of Adama Gert region of Van were decorated with the first snow. Ethnic cleansing of Artsakh was because of our shameful silence, member of the European Parliament. Let's support the state television of Western Armenia. On 21st September, the speech of Armin Wiesaikan, the Speaker of the Government of the Republic of Western Armenia, was held. She referred to the scientific conference dedicated to Goddess Anahit, held on 15 September, where the President of the Republic of Western Armenia, Ms. Lydia Margosyan, Mr. Armenak Abrahamian, the President of the National Council of the Republic of Western Armenia, the Chairwoman of the National Assembly of the Republic of Western Armenia, Ms. Nelly Harutsunyan, Kur Mihir Haikazuni, gave their memorable speeches. In her speech, Ms. President Lydia Markosian emphasized that the conference dedicated to the goddess Anahit is not only an important scientific event, but also a platform for informing the international community about the Armenian heritage. President Armenak Abrahamian highlighted the issue of preserving the historical and cultural heritage of Western Armenia. He emphasized that the goddess Anahit still maintains its influence in Western Armenia and paid special attention to the importance of Holy Springs for the Armenians living in those areas. Ms. Nelly Hayatunyan, chairwoman of the National Assembly of the Republic of Western Armenia, emphasized in her speech the importance of preserving the Armenian identity and passing it on to the next generations. Kur Mihir Haikazuni presented the meaning of Gariz Anahit. At the end of the conference, Mr. Armenak Abrahamian honored medals to the citizens and deputies from Western Armenia, expressing gratitude for their dedication to Western Armenia. The peace agreement between Eastern Armenia and Azerbaijan is necessary for both countries and is the main obstacle for stability in the South Caucasus, noted the Lithuanian member of European Parliament, Petras Altreviskus. He emphasized the demand of Azerbaijan for the change of constitution of Armenia. He emphasized that peace should be real and people should live due to that agreement. Referring to the Armenian prisoners of war, the deputy noted that they should be released as soon as possible and the exchange of prisoners should be part of the peace agreement. As for the right of Armenians of Artsakh to return to their homeland, Osrevikus noted that the right of Armenians of Artsakh to return to their homeland under international protection is not a negotiation position but a mandate based on fundamental principles of human rights and international law. If your enemy dares to think of any evil against your house and family, be the first to attack and wipe out his lineage and uh, reduce from the root and demolish his house to its foundation and bottom. Destruction and punishment must be decisive and unsparing. The house of the enemy must be destroyed to the ground, its existence completely eliminated, so that it can never revive and become a threat to your and your people. Mihir's message called on the Armenian nation to be fearless, strong and unyielding, protecting the home and land from any evil that may threaten the peaceful and safe future of Armenians. Ashot Haritunyan. The pro-Armenian deputy of the Swiss National Parliament, Eric Fontobel, signed a written request with the signatures of 15 other deputies to the executive power of Switzerland regarding the return of Armenians of Artsakh and the restoration of their rights. Next Monday, September 23, the executive of the parliament should answer the following questions. First, does Switzerland recognize the right of Armenians of Artsakh to return to their homeland and exercise their right to self-determination there? The second, does the Swiss delegation intend to raise Artsakh at COP29, the issue of ethnic cleansing and the right of return of its inhabitants? Swiss Armenian historian Manuk Malhasyan informed Orej about this. The highlands of the Adama Kert region of the one of Western Armenia were decorated with the first snow of this year. Even before November, the miracle of nature hastened to cover the village of Yolmakair, which is located 12 kilometers from the center of the region in white, and the heavy rains that have been falling in the area for two days suddenly turned into soft snow, which miraculously covered the village and its surroundings. 
But this time winter hastened to announce its arrival and the village under a blanket of white welcomed the first signs of cold weather. One year has passed since the ethnic cleansing of Artsakh, which became possible due to our shameful silence, wrote Miriam Lexman, a member of the European Parliament on her ex-microblog. We cannot forget that tragedy and must continue to insist on bringing the guilty to justice, supporting the victims and preserving the Armenian culture and religious heritage in Artsakh. Western Armenian television, being faithful to its principles and viewers, continues its uninterrupted work with new approaches. The viewers, as you already know, our television does not engage in self-promotion. It mainly broadcasts the history of Western Armenia, the present and future, with political and other contexts, as well as news that raises various issues. Western Armenia television recorded one of its most important achievements by launching the Western Armenia weekly newspaper, which is aimed at preserving and popularizing our history, culture and identity. We also present the political transition of the President of the Republic of Western Armenia, the government, the National Assembly and other structures in a transparent and accessible manner. Dear compatriots, with your support, the possibilities of our television will be further expanded and strengthened. We are strong together. This was all for today. I wish you good day. Goodbye.